I did a picture with, with Leslie uh, called Lay Girls, starring Gene Kelly and Kay Kendall and Tyna Elg. The director was, was gay and he was an absolute bastard, George Cukor. He was the greatest woman's director ever. He was gay. George Cukor was our director and uh, they say that he was a ladies' director and uh, that may have been true because there were three of us. But uh, Leslie was such a pro. Um, George had the habit of smacking people if he didn't like them. Like, for instance, he would never hit me because I was the lady star, never hit Kay because she was romancing Rex Harrison. It was all too grand, darling, and too marvelous, and too terribly theatrical and all these things. And so he would hit Tyna Elk, who was a little contract player. So if he got mad at any of us, he'd say, oh, Tyna, you silly girl, why are you doing this? And one time, Leslie came over and said, I say, George, must you? George Cukor looked at him and he said, Gerald, Gerald, go away. This is another thing. His part was Gerald. And then, oh, Leslie's wonderful chin came out like, mmm. He said, it's your first time at, um, in America. I'm not going to ask for too much money. Mistake. Never undersell to an American. Oversell. That was what I've learned. If, they, if you ask for less money, they don't think you're any good. It was Gene Kelly's last picture at Metro. After what he had done. Uh, I know what she said, Sir Gerald, and believe me, there's not a word of truth in her, not one word. <laughs> I don't doubt what she told me. I merely question the wisdom of it. So they start to have a fist fight. And uh, Leslie connected with, with Gene. Well, uh, I hate to call anybody a liar, but what you said... Mr. Nichols, that... you were speaking of the woman I'd intended to make my wife. You! Oh! Oh! I'm terribly sorry. Cukor kept this, and he said, oh, my God, and ran over and picked up, you know, Gene and said, wow, that was really some kind of punch. And then Leslie Rother looked, mm, rather nice, and it was so interesting. But he did say, are you any good? When I arrived in Hollywood, he, I said, well, I think so. I mean, think so, yes. I, it's where you're, you're fucking cheap. We only had a couple of scenes. He said, I said, um, he said, I would very much, you know, I, I'm Sybil's, Kay Kendall's fiance. Could you uh, please tell me where she is? I said, well, of course, Sybil at the time was drunk as a skunk. You should pardon me, because that was her whole character. And I said, well, I think she might be out, meaning unconscious. And he said, hmm. And he said, American. And I said, yes. And he said, ew. And I said, hey, holler out the window. And he said, definitely American. And I said, well, north, uh, it's north of Kayak and east of Hackensack and so on. And he said, that's a bit of a sticky wicket, isn't it? What couldn't you love about him? You know, I'd wait. It's, it's a long walk. Uh, Angel? Yes, George? Yell out of the window! American, hmm? Poughkeepsie. Uh, I think I will dash up. You know, there's an interesting thing about Poughkeepsie. It's south of Claverack, and it's west of Mayo Pack, it's east of Nyack, and it's north of Hackensack. It's a bit of a sticky wicket, what? 